bit more where we want oh, it to yeah. be. I've worked with a few other people who realised come across over time, but certainly didn't know about this place. Yeah, it's, I, I stumbled across it. I went on the website and said, oh, but there's only one blend there. You don't have more. Yeah, our website hasn't been updated for about yeah, three years. Yeah, so. and I thought, oh, that's been okay, we're at the start. <laughs> yeah, I, I stumbled across it. And it's great. I just walked over, head, tried to go, boom, boom. Proxima. Oh, so, and you try, try the Proxima. So this is 100% Arabica, uh, four bean blend, very, very flavorsome. So not so much of a caffeine hit, more cut through the milk if you have with milk. Okay. Very oily sort of coffee, so I think you guys will enjoy it. This is a bit, a bit, a bit over. Um, I like it nice and tight. Very yeah. tight. Mm -hmm. They're not bad, actually. No. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And what we do there, we use 18 gram baskets and we get about 23 grams of coffee inside. Wow. And uh, we actually run our shots a bit shorter, a bit shorter than 7 mils. So we have about 24 to 26 mils, plus a little bit of clever, so about 20, yep. 28 mils all up. And we find with that, in that small, very, very fine uh, ground coffee, the, the flavor profile you get, there is a little bit of blonding for acidity yeah. but in a milk coffee. Comes out really well. Yeah, okay. Oh. So I'm actually overfill my. Yeah, I used to run the film when I had the Bacconi. Uh, yeah. I used to run the film all the time. You know, right up there, yeah, yeah. And that was, that was a reason to stop. But um, even though this is 100% rabbit bait, you can see the creme that you get. Because of the Colombian bean, it's very, very, like I said, very flavorous and very oily. Yeah. Very elegant coffee. You get such a great cut through in the milk, and the creme you get is almost like a robusta. I mean, we get a very similar creme. And you see it's starting to blonde now, and I'll show you what effect that has in the coffee as well. Yeah. So before you add a double espresso, this will be a single. Yep. Oh. Just give that a taste. It's a quick slurp over your palate. And then I'll you can. You guys are going to be flying. <laughs> <laughs> that's really, really nice. That is, that's really and nice. How shot. different is that yeah. to what you had before? It's exactly I think the same it, coffee. Huh? Same coffee, completely different profile. But yeah, the profile it, it's now coming back as a, a little bit a, a tingy on the on the back back palate. A bit of fruit. A bit of fruit. Exactly right. But initially it wasn't. It was it was all there. Very full mouth. Very, very full. Yeah, in your that's mouth. That's right. So you, you realize how much difference uh, the grind can actually impact. It's now the it's almost like a caramel sort of flavor. Yeah, yeah. Smell this again. Yeah. Completely different. Two different coffees roasted to the same profile. Different profiles, uh, different composition of coffees, but being coffee, it's all coffee and it smells completely different. Yeah. You'll get you this, you'll get something, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, it's, it's yeah. not that the good thing to yeah, coffee, yeah, yeah. everything else is almost like neg neg yeah. negative, negative so yeah. things yeah. people. So where we use our 20% of us is in the city. If people want that kick, they want to have a good flavor profile of chocolate, caramel, uh, the very traditional sort of coffee flavors, but they want to feel it. They want to have it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You've got the heart side. Yeah, exactly right. That's, yeah. Not, that's exactly what Sweet Maria gave me. Like, exactly and right. Then, funny, like a month afterwards, I was like, okay, I'm ready to calm down again. <laughs> So back to the good age. So you've achieved a lot in that month. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, you got but four promotions in a week. Exactly. <laughs> just wondering why you're doing that well. <laughs> Still a bit quick, but you'll see how much crema we build just from 10% of Buster as well. See, a lot of people would say that's a fine extraction, but I still think it's too quick. Yeah, you just yeah, don't give the, the running, water enough time. Really and it blondes a lot quicker than it does because yeah. it's already extracted all the oils. So that was 60 mils in 20 seconds. Wow. So you have a very acidic sort of flavor in that. Yeah. I went. <laughs> <laughs> too good. Because you the wrong color to it. I'm going to have to come for the four blend. Uh, yeah. Four by the blend and I'll have the flavor. Yeah, yeah.
bit more where we want oh, it to yeah. be. See the dark rich colour of the crema? Yeah. And you know you're getting the real flavours, the oils are coming out where you want them to be. Yeah. I'm going to cut that very short and just show you the difference in flavour profile. Got that? Yeah, well, man. Just a moment. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. It's got that bit, bit, bit salty. Oh, that's a very short one then. Yep.